So I'm going to show you something really cool that Simon uh, linked me to today. He found it randomly on Google, he said. It's uh, a touch screen converter for any LCD screen. And I was kind of like, this is stupid, but um, it actually works. Uh, kind of, it's not perfect, but it kind of works the way it's supposed to. Um, if you've seen this video, you, this is going to be a repeat, but basically you can just move the mouse uh, with your finger and it'll respond to your finger when you get about a couple centimeters to uh, the screen. <clears throat> it's kind of choppy, but it works the way it's supposed to. Um, I probably wouldn't use it every, all the time. Uh, it might be useful in Photoshop maybe, but I haven't tried it yet. You can also um, point at things and it'll, it'll basically jump. So you point at different tabs and it'll go. But again, it's, it's kind of slow, um, and it doesn't always register the finger, like sometimes, sometimes you'll point and it'll take a while to respond. But for the most part, it works. Um, there's also some other features he didn't show, like uh, manual scrolling, where that's what it's called in the program. You basically use two fingers and you, you, you touch the screen at the same time on the side, and it'll go down and then horizontal will bring you back up. So it's kind of like a home and a page down button. Um, and I think there's some other stuff, there's some there's some hand movements that you can train the screen to do, but I haven't trained it yet. Uh, it's kind of, again, it's kind of hard to use. But for the most part, this is pretty cool, I think. It doesn't really take up a lot of resources and it's pretty, it's a pretty small install. So it's kind of cool. Uh, there you have it. Um, you can Google it and just type in touch screen converter. And then it should be there. Alright.